Hello everybody and welcome to this new episode of this Lumion course in where we are going to look at the requirements we need to have a very good experience in Lumion. So first of all we are going to go to the Lumion page lumion.com and here we are going to go to product and requirements. Once we are here in requirements we will read that this program this software is very different than the others that means that it relies on having a very fast graphic card. So that is the very special point that we have to take into account. Look that we have minimum requirements, recommended requirements and high-end requirements. If we go to minimum requirements, we have to look at this information, graphic card. Here we have different examples of graphic cards that we can use. And we have this data, 7,000, we don't know exactly what is the meaning of this data, but we will look at it a little bit later. We have here graphic card memory, and it is said that we need, for the minimum requirements, 4 gigabytes or more, okay? And then we have the CPU, this is the processor. So here we have to look at this information, Intel Core i7 and this model. Okay, here we have as well to look at the system memory or RAM. Here we will need 16 gigabytes or more. And this is the minimum requirements. If we have here less than 16 gigabytes, I can assure you that your computer will not be able to run Lumion. So that is the main information that we have to look at when we take a new computer. The recommended requirements. So let's check this same information, the graphic card. Here, the graphic card, we have 14,000 or higher. And we have these different examples of graphic cards. The memory specifically of the graphic card here is 8 gigabytes, not 4. And if we go to the CPU, we have this Intel Core i7 with this model and in the RAM of the system memory we have in this case 32 gigabytes or more. If we finally go to high-end requirements and we go to graphic card, in this case we have 20,000 pass mark or higher. We have these examples of graphic cards. We have a graphic card memory about 11 gigabytes or more and in the CPU we have in this case this Intel Core with this RAM, let's say 64 gigabytes. Okay, what is the meaning of this data we have seen till now, in this case 20,000 pass mark? If we go below, we will see that here we can find what graphic card we have in our computer to check if our requirements match with the requirements that are needed. And we have in this second point, this pass marked website. Let's click with the right button and let's open a new window. Once we are here in this website, we can check that we have different graphic cards with different punctuations, let's say different numbers. In this case, the highest is 26,000, even more. And this is the model of the graphic card. So. Those numbers we were checking before have a relationship with this data. In the minimum requirements, we needed 7,000 pass mark. That means that we have to check here in this list 7,000. We will go below till 7,000 or even more. And once we are here, then we will find different graphic cards, different models of graphic cards that can be used in our computer to have these minimum requirements. In case, for example, that we are looking for a recommended requirements for the graphic card, then we can check it, go to recommended requirements, go to graphic card and check how many pass marks we need. In this case, 14,000. Then we go to this website again, we go to 14,000 or even more 
and we check which model it is the one that we need. Easy, isn't it? Well, apart of these system requirements, I recommend you strongly that you have a very good look in this website of Lumion because you will find very interesting information about the program in terms of support, in terms of uh, trials that you can download easily, in terms of a very good blog where you can check all the upgradings, you can take many good ideas just looking at this blog, for example, etc, etc. Well, once we have finished to check the Lumion page, let's start opening the program. Well, this is the welcome page in where we are gonna focus on this benchmark window. Look that here we have this warning, critical warning, the computer is so slow. If we click here, here in this benchmark results, we can see our graphic card, which is very slow. And we have here the processor and the gigabytes of this processor. In this case, it is 16 gigabytes. So talking in general, the requirements of my computer, let's say that it is not good, but you will see that with this requirement, with this kind of computer, which is the minimum, we can do many, many things in Lumion. In fact, we will do all the cores with this computer in order that you can see that it is possible and you can work perfectly, almost perfectly. Of course, if you have a better machine, Lumion will run much faster. But with this minimum, you can be so productive. So it is not needed to spend a lot of money if you have this kind of computer. Let's go back and now we will click on create new project. Here we have different templates for the starting point. So we are going to click on create a plain environment. And once we are already here, we will say goodbye and we will continue in the next episode.